Non ne potevo più di vedere persone come Lila Lipscomb soffrire in quel modo. Soprattutto tenendo conto che su 535 membri del congresso, solo uno ha un figlio sul fronte iracheno. Così ho chiesto al caporale Henderson del Corpo dei Marines di accompagnarmi al Campidoglio. Ero curioso di vedere quanti parlamentari avremmo convinto a mandare i propri figli a combattere in Iraq. Yeah. If any way we can get them to enlist uh, and go over there and uh, help out with the effort. Yeah. Got all the one brochures. Of, and one of them's got two children. Oh, yeah. Well, see, there's not many congressmen that have got kids uh, over there. Oh, no. Only one. No. No. You know, so we just thought maybe, yeah. uh, you yeah. know, they, you guys should send your kids there yeah. first. That's you right. know? What do you think about that idea? I don't disagree with it. Oh, you don't? Uh, all right. Oh, good. Well, here, take some brochures <laughs> now. Here, at least take a Marine brochure. I think, yeah. And pass I, it around. I, yeah. Encourage the fellow members that, you know, if they're for the war, to get behind it, you know, and send their own. Thank you, man. Thank you, sir. Thank you very much. Congressman? Michael Moore. How are you doing? Good, good. I'm trying to get members of Congress to get their kids to enlist in the uh, Army and uh, go over to Iraq. Congressman? Congressman? Congressman Castle. Congressman Castle. Congressman. Congressman. Congressman Doolittle. Michael Moore. No, no, I'm wondering if, you, uh, Ovviamente nessuno di loro voleva sacrificare un figlio per la guerra in Iraq. 